striving for a brighter future, our world is witnessing incredible advancements in technology that are reshaping the way we live and move. Groundbreaking innovations are emerging every day to revolutionize our lifestyles and transportation. In today's feature, we'll explore the story of Contemporary Amperex Technology Co. Limited, CATL, the global leader in lithium-ion battery manufacturing. We'll dive into their exciting development of solid-state batteries, an innovative alternative to traditional lithium-ion batteries, and discuss how this breakthrough could transform the battery industry. What makes KTL's latest innovation a game-changer for FHEV and REV battery technology? Stick around as we uncover how they're redefining efficiency, power, and sustainability while tackling the challenges that have held solid-state batteries back for years. Enjoying the content? Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on our latest updates. You may not be familiar with KATL, but they're the world's largest maker of electric vehicle, EV, batteries. Founded in 2011 by Robin Zeng, KTL has become the powerhouse behind some of the biggest names in the EV industry, including BMW, Hyundai, Mercedes-Benz, and Tesla. Their cutting-edge lithium-ion batteries have powered countless EVs and revolutionized energy storage across various sectors. From industrial operations to commercial hubs and even residential settings, KTL's advanced energy solutions are fueling sustainable and dependable energy storage. Yet, KTL's ambitions go far beyond just EVs. They're venturing into new, exciting territories. Their innovations now include backup power systems for critical infrastructure like base stations, UPS, uninterruptible power supply, systems to ensure seamless operations, and off-grid energy solutions designed for remote locations such as islands. CATL is also leading the charge in intelligent energy management with state-of-the-art charging stations tailored for testing and charging optical storage systems. These innovations promise to optimize the entire energy ecosystem, opening doors to cleaner energy integration while improving energy reliability in urban areas and remote environments alike. By continually expanding their reach into forward-thinking energy applications, CATL is playing a pivotal role in building a smarter, greener, and more sustainable future. In 2023, their influence became undeniable. One in every three EVs on the road worldwide was powered by a CATL battery. By August 2023, over 11 million CATL-powered EVs were driving global change. Since 2020, CATL has been a key supplier of LFP batteries to Tesla's Shanghai plant, further cementing its dominance in the EV market. In this episode, Nikolai is joined by Robin Zeng, founder and CEO of CATL, the world's largest battery producer. China's KATL, the world's largest producer of batteries for electric vehicles, EVs, is seeking a second listing in Hong Kong to increase its global presence and improve overall competitiveness. While the technology is still in its early stages, CATL's progress has been impressive. New reports confirm that CATL has entered the trial production phase for its new solid-state batteries. Solid-state batteries offer several advantages over conventional lithium-ion batteries. The prolonged charging times of traditional batteries, ranging from 1 to 12 hours depending on the charger type, are far from convenient compared to the few minutes it takes to refuel a gasoline or diesel vehicle. On the other hand, Ultra-dense batteries boast an impressive energy density ranging from 300 to 500 watt-hours per kilogram, doubling the capacity of traditional lithium-ion. KTL is not alone in its pursuit of solid-state batteries. Some companies have instead looked to semi-solid-state batteries, which don't feature an entirely solid electrolyte. Say I C Motor, the parent of the MG and LDV brands, recently revealed its IML-6 sedan with a 130-kilowatt-hour semi-solid-state battery. QuantumScape, NYSE, QS, is at the forefront of solid-state battery technology 
and is a potential threat to traditional battery technology in the electric vehicle industry. With KTL Innovation, solar and wind energy can be stored efficiently and reliably, providing a stable power supply. In this modern era, the chase for carbon neutrality is essential, and the use of low-carbon emission raw materials is critical in the production process. Ultra-dense battery technology refers to a breed of batteries boasting an exceptionally high energy density. The allure of high-energy density batteries lies in their ability to offer extended operating ranges and improved performance for electric vehicles, such as those manufactured by the pioneering company. I really can't overstate that this ability to use lithium metal anodes without the need for solid electrolytes is a real game-changer. With advancements like silicon anodes replacing traditional graphite, these batteries can significantly increase energy density. For example, silicon anodes can theoretically store up to 10 times more lithium ions compared to graphite, which could potentially raise energy densities to around 400 watt-hours per kilogram. I've recently been reading about some of the breakthroughs from Chinese battery giant CATL. When they say they have a new breakthrough, they almost always deliver on it. KTL has been clear that this is not a lab-scale demonstration. They said this is currently operational in a ton-scale electric passenger aircraft, though we have yet to see videos. I hope you now understand why, since its inception, CATL has grown rapidly and become a major supplier of batteries to a wide range of international car manufacturers. Many have said solid-state batteries are an exciting new technology that can improve the existing battery paradigm and open gateways toward new technology developments. I hope this video has given people a bit of education on plug-in hybrid batteries. There is still skepticism and most people believe solid-state batteries may give mobile phones a longer charge and discharge life and make it safer to use more of the capacity without losing cycle life. Still, until they go into production, it is all speculation. I hope you enjoyed it, and until next time, thanks for watching.